Welcome people of YouTube, it's me, again, Megaluigi93, but this time instead of playing Half-Life 1, I'm playing some Amnesia. The Dark Descent. Yeah, that's pretty much what it's called. Anyway, I'm trying out the original storyline since a friend of mine on Steam decided to give me a gift copy of this, so I figured, hmm, why not? I've had quite a few issues trying to record this game already, so I figured, hmm, might as well try one more time, and if it screws over, it screws over, and I'll just play this game without recording. Of course, then you guys will be able to see how bad I screw up. So, I'll pretty much just let the commentary, let the commentary flow and play it as I see fit. Now, from what I've seen of this game, which isn't all that much because I didn't find it all that interesting when I was watching other people play it on YouTube, which is where, of course, this video is going, I didn't really like it all that much, so this will be a virtually blind walkthrough of me trying to play this game. I'll play it up until I get bored, I guess. Or I could just do a whole commentary since he did pay for the game at full retail price on Steam. Of course, oh well. We'll just see how things go. I don't seem to be having any crashing issues as of late. So, okay. Okay, I know for a fact that there is no sprint, and I can tilt my screen, I can wobble back and forth just like this. I'm a penguin. Wobble, 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 wobble. Okay. Doors open. There's, there should be some stuff in here. Stuff. There's stuff. I'm gonna take this bottle of beer. Smash it. Hmm. Anyway, I don't think I'll have all that much to really talk about while I'm playing Amnesia. Right now, I'm just running around collecting the items which I know are here. Three tender boxes. Because, yeah. Okay, where am I going? I really wish the screen would stop wobbling. Okay, there we go. I pushed the button. Push the door. When I was first recording, I spent roughly ten minutes trying to find out how to open that door. Sadly, I just kept what? Well, lean in this way. Lean in this way. Keep pushing E. Too used to using E. Oh well. Let's see. What's around this corner? I already know what's around this corner. Characters have already passed out. And he just scoots along. He throws himself a little temper tantrum right there. Maybe he's having some kind of fake heart attack. Okay. Go in here, because there's a, a tinder box that I know of. Yeah. Right there. There's a tinder box. This game's supposed to be super scary, but from what I have seen of it, it's... It's just... Kind of boring. Eh. Well, I know for a fact I don't want to go in there. So let's go down here. Follow the trail of mysterious purple ooze. Purple stuff. Now, when I was recording this earlier, I didn't really get all that far. That one door I told you about just kept getting in my way. So I guess we can just start playing some more amnesia. Loading screens. Okay. Wonky, wonky, wonky. Windy, windy, windy. Let's see. Let's see. Some kind of funky bugs on the ground. I never did check to see what was over here. Oh, so that's how you throw. Okay. Let's see. Guess I gotta go find the lantern now. Since got some extra tinder boxes. Didn't even know those two tinder boxes were there when I went through here last time. Oh well. Sanity. 
insanity. Slight headache. And let's just ignore this stuff and pick up my magical lantern. My best friend, Mr. Lantern. Is there any stuff? Oh, it's in this box. Another tinder box. Seven tender boxes. Probably gonna run out of oil. Sit in the sit in the light for a little bit. Let's go look for some more stuff. Yep, it was just about in here where I got to last time. The earthquake rumbled and then my game crashed. I just hate it when that happens. You try to record a game for your peop for the people on YouTube who actually think you're entertaining and the game just crashes. I'm gonna do what I did last time. Take this book right here, because it's the worst book ever written. You know, you know which book I'm talking about. I don't even have to say it. It's the worst book ever written. I put it in there. Turn on the light. Open the door. Let's see what's in here. Okay, so apparently there's, there's goop, oil, quail. Uh, uh let, let's be safe. Turn that off. Don't be afraid, Daniel. See? I can't tell you why, but know this: I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. Redeem us... Okay, I probably should have let that play through, but I'm impatient. I'll just start reading the next one. If there is a next one. I have a feeling there's going to be a whole lot of stupid notes. So I gotta find some old guy and then kill him. That's, that sounds a little mean. Uh, let's, let's break some more bottles. Delicious. Uh, tap. Oil. Bloop. My batteries and my super flashlight are going dead. My oil powered flashlight. Eh. I don't really see why people like this game so much, but. Then again, I have been only playing for eight minutes, eight, nine minutes. It'll probably get to the more interesting parts. This is a left shift. Oh. Okay, so I have to hold left shift. Inside the castle? In a manner of speaking, come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? Is well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Okay, since I just got past there when those old people cut me off, I I don't really see why people like this game all that much. But like I said, I've only been playing it for eight minutes, which of course has been nine minutes. Okay, the noise came from over there. Hmm. So when do I get to that ugly, ugly horny monster guy? When does he eventually show up? Archives. I have no idea what's over here. 